I'm about to do something that by all accounts, I think every professional hairdresser would tell me not to do. These luscious locks that desperately need a haircut used to be a short platinum bald. Thanks to the pandemic and two years of growth, we've gotten here. Do I have too much confidence? Probably. Am I humble enough to be freaking out right now before I do my hair? Yes. Have I done a lot of research? Have I watched way more videos than anyone should ever watch? I'm gonna take all that information that I've been soaking up like a sponge and I'm gonna do it myself. Spencer, what products are you using today? Well, thank you for asking. Schwarzkopf Blonde Me, which is a bond enforcing premium lightener. Up to nine levels of lift. I am gonna be using foils with my bleach. For the most part, we're gonna be using the Blonde Me developer in 20 volume. Let's section this hair. The reason you section your hair is for processing and timing purposes and because the back of the head tends to be darker and take longer to process. If for some reason my timing gets all fudged up, I can rinse out what's done without overprocessing my hair because I don't want to overprocess my hair. According to my calculations, my roots are going to be either 15 to 20 minutes and my mids and ends will be on for 45 to 50. We're going to keep checking the color. I'm going to start with the back of my head. I'm stressed. Everything's fine. You got this. So here I'm just measuring out my powder lightener and my developer. I'm gonna be doing one part lightener to two parts 20 volume developer. We're ready. Okay, so here I am just taking that mixture and I am trying to saturate every single strand. You'll see that I'm also putting foils on top and the reason I'm doing that is because once bleach dries out, it stops processing and also it helps to trap the heat and incubate the hair. The moisture and heat helps the bleach to process. One side done. I'm gonna move on to the other side, finish those up, then I'm gonna do the roots on this side. Finished this side. Now I am applying to the roots. Was my confidence too high? Perhaps. We're gonna hope it wasn't. Around this point, I started to panic because I realized I was running out of time to process my whole head. So I had a little bit of a breakdown. Time was not on my side. I need... We're revamping the technique here. One of the videos I watched, the girl uses seven volume on her roots and 20 volumes on her mid lengths and ends. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Seven volume here, 20 volume in here. We're gonna hope for the best. So typically anyone will tell you, shout out to you Brad Mondo, that you're not supposed to start with the roots by any means. I realized that I could use the seven volume on my roots and the 20 volume on my mids and ends and hope and pray that they were gonna process together. The seven volume would process fast anyway because of the heat from my scalp. So essentially I did this to save time and hoped it worked. Okay, I feel pretty good about this side. Now we're gonna move over to the other side. Now, obviously this is sped up, but I was really trying to work fast just to make sure that everything was processing at the same time. And spoiler alert, it wasn't. This is what we're dealing with right now. I put some water in the cap to keep everything moist because you don't want the bleach to dry out. In 13 minutes, I will be taking this out. Everything looks pretty good. I have not looked at my hair yet. I'm scared. I know my roots are pretty white, but I have no idea how yellow the rest of my hair is. Baby, that's yellow. So I'm currently mixing up a bleach bath, which is one part bleach, two parts developer, one part shampoo. Regardless of what this does, then we're just gonna tone and we're gonna hope for the best. Pray for me. Okay, so we're not quite done, cause she's yellow. It's yellow, baby, even after the toner, it's yellow. So we're gonna have to figure this out tomorrow. Here I am doing a bleach bath for the second time. I didn't want to push my hair too far, but I did want a little bit of lift. I guess the concern with bleach is always like, is your hair gonna fall out? I'm a little nervous. I really hope it's like lifted. I had that on for 10 minutes. I don't know if I should leave it on any longer, but like, I didn't leave it on long enough the first time and that was the problem. Time to wash, hope for the best. Okay, this is what we're working with. It still obviously has a yellow undertone. I can't even talk about my ends, but it seems a little more even. You know what time it is? T18. I have the T18 toner and the well developer. Oh! No one tells you that the toner smells. Because of the amount of bleach I put on my scalp, when I put the toner on, my head started feeling real spicy. I think we're good, so I'm gonna wash it out. I'm scared. Oh, first look looks good. Are you ready? 
Obviously there are still some yellow tones in my hair. For this being my first time bleaching my own hair, this is pretty good. Obviously my ends need a trim, but look how healthy. And it feels so good. I love it. 